people walk in and their first word is always wow. This is going to be the modern face of Oregon as a gateway, not only to the region, but for the world. When they walk in the door coming off the airplane, it will be a great opportunity for us to continue to connect Portland to the rest of the world. The new main terminal is a stunning reflection of what the Pacific Northwest embodies. Ambition is something this community doesn't lack. I think it needs to be reminded, though, that we can do big things here. Portland can be the center of big things. The port was willing to lead with their ethics and their morals and their values and say we need to build locally. They were willing to use an extremely innovative new type of engineered wood product for the entire roof diaphragm to take a force to frame mentality. They can verify and know that all the materials that went into this product, all local resources in order to build this new terminal core was truly phenomenal. The values that they brought forward with this wood connect back to the tribal communities, back to forest health, really tangible things like the number of salmon returning to spawning grounds, the amount of snow we can capture in our forest. The millennia of what it took our Native American peoples to foster, they demonstrated honor and dignity and integrity and were very respectful. And they wanted us to tell our story, to share who we are, so that we can continue to build on the, the wonderful legacies our ancestors have brought and taught to showcase it. Starting with their board, down to Curtis Robin Hood, their director, down to their procurement team that focused on equity. We brought a lot of contractors of color to the project. The spin was 200 million plus. New contractors who had never worked on the airport to see themselves being on a project of this significant size. So I mean, that to me is uh, how you invoke change. We need to have the sense of optimism what we can do if we dream. This goes back to that pioneering experience that Oregonians have, but also the very best minds in this region that are leading the research and innovation in material and design. With innovations in wood products and new ways to use our, our natural resources that will truly surprise the world. Completely new and innovative approach to construction. 80 foot curved glue lambs never been done before. Over 2 million board feet of lumber and a nine acre roof, 55 foot tall Y columns. There was really no stone unturned in the planning with the port for this project. And they gave that room and space to talk about how we could execute that vision. Source, design, construct, all of that locally has immense significance. That we can have a positive human footprint if we're intentional. And it's such a counter narrative this is a moment when we can show our children a path. You're showing them the best part of who we are as they are, are welcomed in. It's that embrace and acknowledgement and appreciation of our home. This was a once in a lifetime opportunity, right? It's a 50 year building. There's 20 million people that are gonna go through here at least every single year. When people come to this airport, when they come to this region, not always do they know a whole lot about Oregon and they look around and they're going to see this beautiful roof and it's a reflection of our state. They're going to be able to come here and say, I'm really interested to learn more about this area. And we've had folks internationally come to see us and ask us, how did you do this? Because they want to figure out, can this be replicated? And the answer to that is yes. It creates a blueprint a roadmap for how you can replicate projects like this. Trade enriches people's lives, it can create opportunities and potentially intergenerational wealth. For us, connecting big and small businesses to international markets is the same story. To the people that are actually partook to this, there's thousands of people being a part of it. All the local crafts people that are here. We have small businesses mentoring small businesses mentoring small businesses, right? An absolutely wonderful gift to the rural communities. And all those people deserve a chance to, to be part of something bigger like the Portland Airport Project. They all showed up and said, yes, what is possible? It's a testament to what this region can do. That I hope is the new beginning for a new generation of Oregonians but a very different one. I mean, I can't believe that I stand here as an immigrant to be a part of creating this front door. It's a big honor. I think for the Oregonians that are traveling abroad, then come back to Oregon, they should be thrilled to just feel in that pride. And that for the region, it means a comeback. It means something we can be proud of. What it really inspires, I think, is the question of, what are you going to do? What's your opportunity to make a big difference? Mm -hmm.